Hey Buffalo Fanatics, welcome back to another Madden video, and today we're going to be playing Browns vs. Bills, Tyrod Taylor's Browns versus Nick Foles' Bills. So let's see how this works. I know the Bills are rated a little low here, but that's because of all the free agent signings and everything and how Madden rates the players, so I can't control that. I kept them how they are, I didn't change it whatsoever, so let's get right into it and see how they do. Here's Vontae Davis. Let's see if he's actually in this video. I know he wasn't in last video. I don't know why Madden wouldn't put him in there. But let's see how, it, how he does. There's Nick Foles. Let's see how he does on the Bills. That would be a nice pickup to get him. And a welcome in, everybody, with Charles Davis. I'm Brandon Gordon, and Charles, so much gets made about offensive I also have Star Lutalele on here as well, and a couple other signings that the Bills got recently. Got Jarvis Landry, Tyrod Taylor right here. Here comes Tyrod Taylor. Didn't do so well with the Bills. Broke the drought. He's being known as a drought breaker. Let's see if it, he holds up to his name. Oh, there's Poyer. They're running the ball. Alright. First play of the game. Didn't go so well. Defense. Really got to pick it up. Hopefully, Bills pick up somebody for the linebacking core. That'd be nice. Nice run stopper. Oh, there's Raphael Bush. I got him in there. See, Tyrod. Almost intercepted by EJ Gaines. Tyrod, first throw incomplete, so he's not going to do too well. Let's see how Nick Foles does. Here comes Nick Foles, starting quarterback of the Buffalo Bills. If he could perform like he did throughout the Super Bowl for this whole season, if he gets picked up by the Bills, we're not saying that he will or anything. But if he does, that would be nice. Let's see. Foles, get it in there. Oh, just like I... No, oh, okay. Almost threw it up like that. He could have caught it. Oh, KB, you got to hold on to that one. I see Andre Holmes. Oh, or no blocking and sack. Let's see how Tyrod handles a blitz. It's not often that I play against Tyrod. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, that worked perfect. All right, Taylor hit Jarvis Landry right there. Not a nice throw. It's third and two. All right, Tyrod, nice throw. Completely missed the guy, but nice throw. And here's the defensive line for the Bills. This is a solid defensive line, I'd say. Linebacking crew, eh. It has its flaws, but it has its strengths as well. And then secondary, the SWAT team. You know I'm all about the SWAT team. That's where plays are made. That's where turnovers happen. Oh, Tyrod looks like he's running the ball. Probably put QB contain on Tyrod. But it was a complete pass right over the middle. Easy pass. I think I am. Alright, Tyrod threw a two yard pass. Went out of the three yard line. Looks like they're going to kick the field goal. A short gain that doesn't get them the first down brings up a fourth down situation. Really nice job defensively. They knew where the sticks were, they got the stop before it. And it is 3-0. First score of the game, Cleveland Browns. And Thompson on a comeback. And a, a sack. Deion Dawkins did not hold his coverage. Three tight ends and Deontay Thompson. Hopefully they think they were running the ball. There we go. Right on target. Deontay Thompson, DT, our deep threat. It's a big play. 
Let's see Nick O'Leary. It's like Deontay Thompson. There we go. Nice. Nick Foles are sit fitting in there real good. And it's intercepted. Nick Foles, you got to throw that deeper than that. KB was open outside. Let's uh, actually just run. <laughs> run commit. And safety. Safety. Zoe Alexander in for the two points. So far, both quarterbacks not really doing as good as you want. All right, what do you expect of the tie ride he's doing? You know, just scrambling around, throwing the ball, not on target. Nick Foles, he's been on target except for one throw, and that's been intercepted. Other two throws haven't been caught. But here's the halftime stats right here. Negative two rushing yards. I'm just trying to throw the ball. Hopefully comebacks open with Benjamin. Oh, it's wide open. Oh, man, you can't be more wide open than that. Once I saw that, I just immediately threw it. Nick Foles is really good in these RPOs, so hopefully he can continue that. And he is right on target. KB, that's what we want to look forward to this year. Nick Foles to Kelvin Benjamin. Oh, let's take an end zone shot right here. I'm feeling it on this play. I'm feeling it. And we felt it. KB, end zone, up top. Now let's put Charles Clay in an out instead of a, a fade out. Because he's going to be open right there. Oh, he dropped it, though. He dropped it. Oh, Jordan Poyer. Easy interception. Tyrod Taylor. Terrible passer. He should have never threw that one. Oh, that was a terrible decision right there. Terrible. I should have seen that linebacker lurking. Tyrod will turn it over again. Or just throw it out of bounds. You know, interception out of bounds. As long as it prevents them from scoring, that's pretty good. Oh, it's a screen. It's a screen. Kyle Williams read that perfectly. That's what I like to see right there. Bring it on back. That's what we need. That leadership on the field. Score is 3 to 8, end of third. Hopefully Tyrod does not run with it. Oh, nice. A fumble. Let's go, White. Another fumble recovery touchdown for Tredavious White. Tyrod Taylor fumbled it. Tried to make the play for himself as usual. Captain Checkdown just couldn't find anybody in that play. Tried to make a play for himself. Oh, Checkdown. Never mind. That Checkdown worked. He trucked me. Up him again. Keep Tyrod passing him. Wow, that was a nice throw on the run right there to Jarvis Landry. I believe that was the first throw and catch to Jarvis Landry today from Tyrod Taylor. Surprised he even threw that. It looked like he was going to run it. A little underneath. Oh, Tyrod's running it. That was a nice catch by Gordon. He had to stretch out for that one, though. I think they'll intercept it, cause a fumble. Look at that. Right in front of him. White just slapped that ball away. Swatted that ball away. That's what he's here for. Oh, Micah Hyde. Oh, look at that. Micah Hyde. Ooh, nice. 
conservative. He's sticking to his game plan. No, that is his oh, game. Charles Clay, wide open. All right, Nick Foles, what do you got here? Oh, okay. Don't know where that was too. But that was only a second off pass of the game. Alright, that was a little too far. Nick Foles kind of overthrew that one. So it's number three bad throw on the day. He's kind of getting up there now. Looks like there's no safety help. That was too easy. Oh, come on. Deontay Thompson, you got to hold on to that one. So he handles a blitz under pressure. Oh, you just had to throw that one away. Oh, Tyrod, nice floater up and over the linebacker and in for a touchdown. But it's a little too late, Tyrod. Final score is 15 to 10. And here's the end game stats. Bills led in every category except for passing and rushing. But they were close in passing. Rushing, I, I didn't run at all except for like three plays. But here's the quarterback comparison right here. In my opinion, Nick Foles was a lot more on target. So don't forget to uh, like, subscribe, and share this video to see more. And don't forget to comment down below what kind of Madden scenario you guys would like me to see. Now, throughout this whole free agency process and draft, I will be adding more players. So just leave it in the comment which one you would like to see first. There is one thing that I forgot to put in this video, and that was Chris Ivory. So if you guys would like to see how Chris Ivory does on the Bills, that might boost up the Bills rating from a 79. I know it's, that's really low for Madden. When you subscribe, hit that notification bell, to, and it'll notify you every time Buffalo Fanatics uploads a video. So you can be the first one to comment down below what you'd like to see next. So until next time, I'm out.